Hello everyone, Neil from Merchant Former here. Today I want to go over the Favorites module and how you can quickly set that up after you've logged in. So when you log into the software, you want to navigate over to the little heart icon here on the left that says Favorites. And you should be taken to this page here, and there should probably be only one category here. It will not look like this. So this is a great way to stay organized and basically put your designs in a category tree structure so that you can easily reference them and send them to different designers. So as you see here, I have some dog t-shirts set up and then I have some subcategories under there. Now if you want to add a category, you click add category. Now let's just say that I wanted to add collie. So I'd enter collie here and it would be a category by itself. Click, simply click this, drag it, and you can put it anywhere under here. So we're gonna put it right under dog t-shirts and always make sure to hit save. As you can see, it's been updated, so your categories will now be saved. It's very important that once you add a new category or add a subcategory that you hit save, because if you do not hit save, next time you come back to the screen, your category will not be there, and you'll have to add it again. Now, one of the things I like to use this for is that I have 8,000 slots currently available on my account, so I have multiple designers. Some like just the picture from Amazon, some like just the link, others want to see the product details. So I've set up two different categories here, one for Ashley and one for Jacob, which could possibly be two of my designers. And as you can see, currently there's no products here. So what we would do is we go over to the product search module and let's just type in pug. Now that that's loaded, let's scroll down here and we see some t-shirts. These are not merged by Amazon shirts because we did not select the only by Amazon. So we're just searching right now. And let's say we come across this t-shirt. We would click the little icon that says add to favorites, scroll up, click add to favorites. Now you see your categories. You wanna pick the pug category, click submit. And as you can see, it's been a success. So if you navigate back over to your favorites and select the pug category, I've already pre-added some over here. You'll be able to see the favorites categories here. Now, once you have the products in the categories that you want to send to your designers, all you need to do is come over here, select the category, and click download product list. From here, you're able to download different attributes into a CSV file. These can be title, link, image URL, ASIN, price, features, and description. You can unselect which ones you don't want, selects which ones you do want, and when you're happy with the selection, simply click Submit, and it will download your spreadsheet, which you can clearly see everything is lined up right here and ready to be sent off to your favorite designer.